are shining the spotlight on the black team of climbers who are now in the history books. Their feat to reach new heights is an inspiration to future climbers. And that's why the men and phenomenal women in this group are our revolutionaries of the week. A victory that ascended into history. So earlier this week, the team went up higher through this ice fall that you see right here, the Kumbu ice fall. Uh, we went above there to some higher camps to get used to higher elevations, breathing with a little less oxygen. A few days ago, we flew into Lukla and we started hiking um, in, in the Kumbu Valley. It's the valley below Mount Everest. There's no roads. Full Circle Everest. The first all-black expedition to make it to the top of Mount Everest, the highest mountain in the world above sea level. And once you get to the summit, it's like getting back down safely and that, like your focus has to be there. And if it's not, I think it, you know, increases kind of the danger and other things around you. A journey that took months of trekking and training to fight to the finish. Personally, for me, it was such a huge accomplishment and such a huge effort. It felt really cathartic. You know, I, I certainly shed tears at the summit and I think it was for all of the the effort and, and all of, you know, my entire path through life to take me to that moment. Seven members along with Sherpa guides helped make it all happen despite the obstacles that came along the way. You know, I served in Iraq for 12 months in combat. And so you learn to work in a tight knit group. You weren't learn to negotiate terrain features and plan the logistics of things and your movement to account for all of your gear and make sure that it's working because it, you may need it to save your life or save someone else's life. A feat for the history books and for the next generation. And I hope that, you know, we do make the splash in history and influence more people of color to get outside, to, to get an outdoor education and to explore the world, have fun.